The developer of a 12,000 seat amphitheater in Broken Arrow says seats are already selling even though it won't open for two years. He says the venue will bring in big names and entertainment plus bring an economic boost to the city. News on 6's Emery Bryan has more. The construction underway in Events Park is not for the amphitheater, but the developer does expect to start moving dirt at the first of the year. This is the plan to build an outdoor concert venue expected to host about 60 events each year. Coming out of COVID, live entertainment outdoors took off and it's going to continue to take off. There is a lot of supply of artists and there's a lot of demand by by fans and so developer J.W. Ross says Broken Arrow was chosen for its available land with highway access near his other projects in Oklahoma City, Kansas City and Fort Worth. Before the layout of the project is approved, the Planning Commission and the City Council have to approve. But the developer said generally the audience will overlook this lake and the sound will project out towards the turnpike. The city says before any final decisions are made, public input sessions will be held. Their private commitment for this project is somewhere between, you know, 70 and 71 million dollars. The city plans to spend about 20 million dollars to buy more land and make improvements to the park. The suggested site for the amphitheater is just north of Events Park on private land the city plans to buy. There's not a more exciting project that we have than the one we're building in Broken Arrow. To handle the demand, Broken Arrow will upgrade roads and add entrances to the park, expecting to need more capacity for sellout concerts with some of the front row premium seats already selling. In Broken Arrow, Emory Bryan, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.